Okay, what's up, Pisces? It's your girl, Dominique, with Empathic Guidance, and I'm back with another video for you guys today. And today, I'm back with your mid-month of May. So, let's see what's coming in for the sign of Pisces. Whoop. Okay, wait, Pisces. <laughs> Somebody feel friends on it here, okay? So, Pisces, you could have felt like you were meant to come into somebody's life and heal them, and they friends on it you instead, Okay. All right, I mean, I don't mean that you can't heal them, though, Pisces. You still can, but maybe you felt like you was meant to have a connection with this person. Okay, what else is coming in? Yeah. You could be feeling like you was meant to be this person's husband or this person was meant to be your husband. We are not meant to work for other, for somebody else. Chivalry is dead. So, some, okay, I don't know why, but it feel like I'm talking to a nice guy. All right? You might be a nice guy and you feel like you got friends on it when you're supposed to be husband material. You can feel like the person that, you know, you focused on right now, like maybe they facing some addictions or you feel like they more attracted to the bad boy type. Like, you know, and you feel like they too highly favored for that. It's like, why are you so highly favored chasing after trash? Like, you don't want to end up changing who you are to align with what it is that you notice that women in today's society is attracted to, okay? Yeah, all right? So, you guys are stepping into entrepreneurship. Pisces is what I'm seeing here, okay? So, it's like y'all on y'all shit and y'all kind of feel like the person that y'all got y'all eye on, they attracted to some BS. Y'all just kind of like, why is it that, that, that that's your type? You know, you wondering. Like, well, you highly favor. Why is it that that's your type? So, yeah. Y'all bank account is, y'all might be opening up a new bank account. So, this could be a business account, okay? Or y'all may be getting ready to take out some type of loan for a business. All right? Yeah, you see this person. So, you see somebody in a very high light Pisces. And maybe you feel like you was meant to kind of come in and help this person heal their heart. And, you know, through your chivalry and everything else. But maybe you feel like this person having a hard time letting go of the types of people that they were supposed to leave in a south node. You know? Yeah, Middle Eastern sneaky link. Yeah. This person might have a gen spirit on them. Okay? So, even if they are highly favored, they could have dealt with somebody that was low vibrational, that left a gen spirit on them. They could have had a sneaky link with this person. So, maybe you feel like uh, y'all have a past life connection and this person is not coming in doing what they're supposed to do. Okay? Somebody in this situation can have a dimple. I feel like y'all letting this person go because y'all feel like it's too hard for them to learn a lesson. Like, they don't know how to do their release work and fully release the past. And that's why they keep having to perpetuate relationships that they complain about. And they might complain to you because it friends on is here. So, I'm not sure if this person knows. This person may be Middle Eastern or Asian. Or this may be other options that you have outside of this individual. And you might be feeling like, you know... I want to come and see your life and do what we're supposed to do in this lifetime. But basically, if you're going to be stubborn, I'm not about to force you. Like, you got to be willing to heal. So, you just, you you on this wave. You on this wave. But again, you could be a woman as well. And the same thing remains. It's like, you feel like the good attribute, the attributes of a good woman or a good man is kind of overlooked these days. Okay? Yeah. Okay. seductive okay so pisces you could see this person that you fixated on is very seductive like that don't mean that they promiscuous or out there but this person could be like a sex worker healer okay so it don't have to mean that they out here sleeping with men but just like oshun and other like goddess of sensuality and stuff like that how they can heal, you know, uh, the opposite sex through their chakras. Maybe you're dealing with that type of person. And maybe that's why they keep attracting lustful spirits into their life. And it, you may feel like they have, uh, like, an issue, like, differentiating what they should be involving themselves in versus what they should be releasing. And it's kind of growing exhausting to you. It's kind of like, I'm trying to stick by your side. I'm trying to be here to do what it is that I'm supposed to do. But you keep putting me in a friend zone. Or you feel like you tired of waiting for this person to evolve out of this or to gain more from this than being in a friend zone. And feeling like this person keeps choosing the wrong type. Okay, so this is somebody that's stubborn with their lessons. Damn, this could be a twin flame. All right. 
This person needs to eliminate a Jezebel spirit from their energy, a bisexual one at that. So they could be dealing with a, uh, like the other person, could be a bisexual male, okay? I could be talking to Pisces male, but again. All right, so why is friends on here? Y'all might feel like this you exactly what this person needs, but they keep going after what they want. Yeah. You feel like you too good for that. You like, hell no, nah, maybe next lifetime. Okay, so y'all might be feeling like this mission is coming to an end, Pisces. Because you like, I ain't about to take the backseat to a fuck boy. Like, what kind of sh Or I ain't about to take the backseat to a fuck girl, depending on who you are watching. But just keep in mind, you could be this divine feminine that this Pisces masculine is, like, fixated on. Like, why in the hell you not getting a hint? You know, like, why after all the interactions that you have with reptilians, you can't tell scales from skin? Wow, damn. You could be this person's neighbor. Y'all could live in the same neighborhood or y'all could live in like neighboring towns or something to that extent. But I'm definitely getting that. Yeah. I love you more than them. Let's see. All right. So I love you more than them. Why is that here? Why is I love you more than them here for Pisces? Energy is currency. Yeah, so this person may be telling you that they love you, but you, like, uh, every time you look up, like, maybe this person sitting up with a new lover and secretly is making you jealous, but you, like, I'm not about to lose my shit over this no more, okay? Um, so, yeah, I see, I just see a masculine here that's trying to do the right thing, okay? Trying to, all right? I really do feel like that husband. Why is this here? Y'all, yeah. I want your life. Yeah. So it's like, why in the hell do I have to, you know, like you kind of feeling like, why am I having to wish for the life that I'm supposed to be a part of? Like, when are you going to wake up and get the hint? That's kind of how you feeling. It's like, I shouldn't have to be jealous over people that should be out of your life. So yeah, Penn State Federal or Penn Federal State, USA. Daughter. Some of you guys, if you recently had a child, like you setting up some type of, uh, I don't know, like one of those accounts that accumulate until they turn 18 and then they can take it out. What is that called again? A CD or something like that? Continue doing what you're doing, Pisces, all right? You don't have to be a martyr for this connection is what Spirit is saying. Like, yeah, y'all might have a new daughter that y'all truly adore, okay? And y'all feel like y'all got to make decisions according to that all right alpha female yeah this person is an alpha female they need to alkalize their life you know um and alkalize whatever they not supposed to have in their life out their life and that's how y'all feeling too because y'all might feel like they keep attracting pieces of shit and you know it could be it could be stemming from their toxic past it could be stemming from their toxic family like maybe their family keep getting involved in trying to advise them on who to be with and where to go and stuff like that and you just kind of like, you know, you you see this person as somebody that the potential of them is so much more. But it's like, you know, I can't convince you of your potential if you don't see it for yourself. So, yeah, Pisces, y'all coming down. You know, I mean, understandably so. Because if it was the other way around and it was a divine feminine that was wanting her masculine to get their shit together, they would be just as frustrated. Okay? You feel like you can bring, like, protection into this person's life. So, maybe they just keep getting attacked by a lot of different uh, negative, low vibrational, lustful energy. And you, like, I mean, if you would stop beating around the bush, you could have the protection that you need to be able to move forward. But you keep making the same mistakes, and that's why the universe keep putting you in a cycle. Okay? So, let's see. Pisces. What's coming in for Pisces for the month of May? Yeah. Y'all pulling back y'all love offer, okay? Y'all definitely are. Y'all thought that this was going to lead to a, a, a committed romantic relationship. You know, you really tried to sweep this person off their feet, but it's like they might rather, you might be feeling like this person rather get knocked off their feet than swept off their feet. Yeah, and you feel like no matter how much 
you try to position yourself so that they can see you differently and see you as the one like this person just choose to stay blinded to who you truly supposed to be in their life okay what's coming in for you guys Okay, so I am get. I don't know how old y'all daughter is. Like, I don't know if, like I said, if they a toddler or they a newborn. But I'm seeing somewhere within this two weeks, y'all might be going to like the circus. Oh, the Universal Circus or something like that. But I'm definitely getting, this could be like a birthday party or something like that. Because I'm seeing like it's a magician there or whatever. And so you could be feeling yourself too, Pisces. Like, yeah, you know, like... You might be magical on a whole nother different level than a magician that's at a kid's party. But again, like this might be right up your alley. Like this shit fun. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> y'all tapping into y'all inner childhood. But my thing is, even if y'all daughter is like super young, like they just came into this world or whatever. Like y'all might have a niece, nephew, co-worker's child or something like that, that whose birthday party y'all might go to and y'all not gonna regret it. It's gonna be like, okay, this is really dope. It's cool as hell. Y'all, cause I'm seeing two kids here, a boy and a girl. Okay, so it could be twins whose birthday is coming up. All right, in Gemini season. So yeah, some of you guys can actually be a teacher. I mean, whether that's a spiritual teacher or an actual academic teacher. Or are you going for this role now? It's like you really optimistic about a new cycle for yourself. You tired of somebody self-sabotaging. It's just kind of like you just keep self-deceiving. Maybe this person is even convincing themselves that somebody else is their twin flame. And you feel like, you know, they getting ready to miss the opportunity with this new beginning. Because maybe you guys are ready to move on. You might be about to block them and get married. Okay. You can't keep investing in this. You got to make a choice from your yourself. Yeah, and with the emperor and the empress in reverse, you may be feeling like this person do not recognize or they putting all their energy into a false twin flame connection, a low vibrational connection where they being hexed, okay? So here's the thing, y'all. What really could be going on is that somebody could be confusing them by hexing them and putting up illusions that they the real twin flame, yeah, and they could have been going in circles for this for a long, long time. And it's stopping this person's growth when it comes down to their creativity, work, fertility, anything else. When this is like a karmic situation. So you're right. They are chasing the wrong one. But I will say this, Pisces. That person is hexing them to make them believe that they they true twin flame. Okay? So they got a masculine in their life that's like manipulating the energy. To put up a veil that they are their real twin flame. So, you know, you might be fed up with this empress. <laughs> but, um, somebody done really did some dark and heavy shit to, like, brainwash them into thinking something that's not true. That they a lower, they a higher vibrational soulmate when they ve very much low. Very much low vibe. Y'all, something might be being revealed to this person. Some of you guys may be actually expecting Pisces, and that might be the last and final straw for you. Like, well, shit, you know what? I'm already starting a legacy with somebody else, so we could just say that you pretty much missed the opportunity with me. You know, some of y'all may be feeling like that, okay? Because some of y'all may be, like, it may be illuminated at the end of this month that you actually are expecting a child, or a gender can be being revealed here, okay? You do have a goat and child on the way. Um, for some of you, y'all might name that child Faith or Adoration, okay? And for others of you, even Oshun, maybe, because I'm seeing a lot of sunflower vibes. This child is going to be extremely different. Y'all, I'm telling you, Pisces, some of y'all walking away from something. Y'all feel like y'all been at a crossroads with this situation for long enough. So y'all may be trying to go ahead and build something with the person that you pregnant by. Yeah, it's like I got to I gotta do what makes sense for me now. Because I've been trying to make shit make sense in your life for too long, Pisces. That could be what y'all saying to this person that y'all have to leave behind. That's supposed to be a divine feminine, but she being held on to by a karmic in her life. And she may be believing that that person is her twin. Okay, yeah, y'all feel like they missed the opportunity. It's being revealed to them too. That, you know, so this may be somebody that overlooked you or overlooked you or overlooked you, Pisces. But the minute you post that you married in a relationship or got a new woman, 
this person gonna be hurt the fuck. Okay, they gonna be hurt the fuck. Not even gonna lie. They gonna be feeling like, damn. Y'all. And stuck with some ungodly shit. Stuck with an ungodly person that don't even have the same belief system as them. You manifesting the life that you want, Pisces. Some of you guys may be going back to like a childhood lover. Um, you or you know, you might be running into this person. Yeah, you really wanted to collab with this individual, but again, they just did they never made a decision. So you could have been putting yourself out there and this person was just ignoring your advances or acting like they didn't know or blocking them. They could have had you on silent. Had your notifications on silent. Yeah. Y'all. Y'all getting a new opportunity because y'all protected. Because, you know, again, it's Earth Angel energy here. So harmony and balance is being restored in your life. Somebody that's willing to pour into you as well. The truth is being revealed to you or this person. Somebody is finding out now. Okay? So, again, this ain't something you about to hide, Pisces. Even if you did have interest in somebody else, if they wasn't giving you a chance, okay, you still was doing what you was doing, okay? You don't have to stop doing what you're doing if somebody not giving you a chance. And now you could be finding out that you yielding a child from this or you could have been found out that this person was pregnant, but it could be really settling in now, finding out that you're getting ready to have a daughter. So now y'all getting ready to prepare. Y'all opening up a bank account just for them, you know, to accumulate funds while they grow up so that they can have that generational wealth when they turn 18. They can pull that out. They can use it for college. They can use it to buy a car, fund they house, you know, fund their housing and stuff for a while. But, you know, you about to prepare. And see, it's like somebody here is really not going to know what they're missing until they see you happy with somebody else. So, and y'all like, that's not my problem. And it's not, Pisces. It's definitely not. You know, somebody here just missed out. Y'all, bottom of the deck, new life. So, for some of you, you finding out. For others of you, y'all actually finding out the gender. And that's prompting y'all to go and prepare for y'all baby girl. And it's crazy that I adore you came out. So some of y'all can be naming them Amor or Adore or Adoration or Faith, Sunflower, Ocean. But her name may definitely have like a nice spiritual meaning to it. Anything else for Pisces? Yeah, you don't feel like you can fix this situation. So my thing is once you upload or share with the community or yeah on social media i'm telling you <laughs> it's like you feel like y'all oh my god like somebody tried to friends on you when you was really a soulmate and they gonna find out through the grapevine that or through social media look at them looking at your shit and you're not gonna be able to fix it because you're gonna be like i've been trying to convince you forever why is it now that I got a new family and this and that, that you have to all of a sudden want to fix it, want to talk about it. You know, when this person just tried to friend zone you and keep you in the friend zone while they was out here fucking with junkies and people that pop pills and drink potion. Y'all, this person going to be hurt. Classic case. But this time around, it's the feminine energy that's fucking up. Y'all, you feel like this person got some growing up to do. That they still need to nourish their soul. And you're not about to stop the new cycle you just created for this person. So you might stop hanging around a friend group that you was hanging around with this person. Or if you was in some type of group, whether it was a Facebook group or y'all was a part of the same community. You could be leaving that community behind or not hanging out with those people. Because you don't want it to be awkward. You know? Yeah. You feel like this person was unclear for too long. That you lost hope. That gave you room to lose hope. Okay. You feel like this person always dated down because they got insecurities. And because they need control. Y'all. 
they needed to release karmics that don't even feel the same way about them. But it's like, while they was holding on to karmics, they was making you feel like you was in an unrequited love situation. So while they was chasing something unrequited, they was causing you to be in the same energy as them. And they caused the stalemate. All right? Because y'all might be getting ready to marry this person that's having y'all baby Pisces. All right, y'all. Building a happy family. You and this person not going to be able to fix what's damaged here. Okay, y'all? Yeah. Damn, y'all. That's it. You feel like this person got trust issues they need to heal, but at the same time, they keep on attracting and allowing the people in their life that cause those trust issues. So, yeah, y'all. Y'all at the end of the rope with this person. Y'all done. Okay? All right. Hopefully, this helped. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Join the Soul Tribe, and I'll check you guys out in the next one. Peace.